Welcome back, Cassie Sports fans. I'm Clark the Bomber Higginbotham. And I'm Bobby Sanford and Son. Our next opponent sent your Cassie Cyclones to Dallas, Texas, where we took on Episcopal School in Dallas. On the Cyclones' first play from scrimmage, Taquan, the great Wallace of China, hit athletic trainer Crossno on the big play that gave the Cyclones a 7-0 lead. In the second quarter, Daquan Wallace connected with Denver Broncos Johnson and he was chased down by an ESD defender for this big game. A few plays later, Sam I Am Smith gave the Cyclones a 10-0 lead. Blake the Brick Baldwin blocked this ESD field goal. ESD got on the scoreboard, making the scores 10 to 7. That was also the score at the half. Cassidy up 10-7. ESD would strike first in the second with this touchdown pass. ESD 14, Cassidy 10. Daquan, the great Wallace of China, connected again with athletic trainer Crossno for his second touchdown reception of the game. Cassidy up 17-14. ESD tied up the game at 17-17 with this field goal. James Bennett there done that, forced this fumble, and Gary, I wish you would, recovered the ball. A few plays later, Sam I Am Smith connected on his second field goal of the night. Cassidy 20, ESD 17. James Bennett, like Beckham, applied pressure on the quarterback, forcing this grounding penalty. Unfortunately, the officials didn't see it that way and ruled it incomplete. A few plays later, ESD completed this go-ahead pass, giving them a 24-20 lead. That would also be the final score of the game, the Cyclones in a close loss. This has been Bobby Sanford and Son and Clark Bomber Higginbotham signing off. off.